Good day everyone. Today we will discuss about the addition of fraction. Okay, so when it comes in addition of fraction, we have two types to consider. Number one, with the same denominators. And number two, with different denominators. Yes, guys, merong two types to consider ang addition or fraction. Ikaw nga, marami kang type. <laughs> okay, so now we will tackle about the addition or fraction with the same denominators. Because magkaiba ang rules when it comes with the same denominators and different denominators. So, let's have examples. Example letter A is 1 half plus 1 half. So, 1 half plus 1 half, since both denominators are the same, what we're gonna do is just copy. So, we will just copy the denominator, which is 2. And when it comes to the numerator, we will just add 1 plus 1. So, 1 plus 1, the answer is 2. And then 2 divided by 2, the answer is 1. So, 1 half plus 1 half, the answer is 1. Okay, so let's have more examples with the same denominators in addition of fraction. So, let's have example letter B. Example letter B is 1 half plus 3 halves. So, 1 half plus 3 halves is equal to, since the denominators are the same, which is 2, what we're gonna do is just copy. So, we will just copy the denominator, which is 2, and then add the numerator, 1 plus 3, the answer is 4. And then 4 divided by 2, the answer is 2. Okay, letter C. Letter C is 2 over 3 plus 8 over 3. Again, just copy when the denominators are the same and add the numerator. 2 plus 8 is 10. And 10 divided by 3, the answer is 3 and 1 third. You can check whether 10 divided by 3, the answer is 3 over 3 and 1 third. Okay, we are through discussing the addition of fraction with the same denominators. Now, it's your turn. Okay, so... What is the answer for number 1? Number 1 is 3, 3 fourths plus 5 over 4. So, what is the answer for 3 over 4 plus 5 over 4? And number 2, what is the answer when we add a 4 fifth or 4 over 5 plus 7 over 5? Let me know your answer in the comment section.